everybody. Welcome. Happy Saturday if it's Saturday in your part of the world. My name is Sherry Elise and I am the co-founder of the Wellness Universe and the beautiful woman sitting next to me is... Hello everyone. Thank you for joining us. I am Anna Pereira, the founder of the Wellness Universe and we have a wonderful, 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 wonderful show scheduled for you. So thank you for joining us and be sure to share this out while you're here because you're going to get the top tips to live your best life. <laughs> Woo -hoo! Yay! We are super excited to be here with you guys today. Say hello if you are watching us live right this very moment uh, because you guys have an amazing opportunity. Hello, Jess. Hey, Raylan. I know you. <laughs> <laughs> so today um, we have a special treat for you. We are going to be sharing and introducing you to uh, five amazing women from around the world who are our Wellness Universe World Changers, and they are gonna be sharing with you their number one top tip for your best life. And uh, we have an amazing contest for you. For those of you guys who have been following, you know that we have a huge event coming up, a retreat called Soul Treat, and we are gonna be giving away one free ticket to a lucky winner at the end. And there's only a few things that you have to do. So before we even dive into this interview today, let's get started with the number one thing that you have to do out of your first step. And that is to share this interview. So if you wanna be entered into this contest to join us November 2nd and 3rd in Sedona, then you need to share this right now. And then we'll give you a couple of the other steps throughout this Facebook Live. Sounds and good to me, Sherry. Yeah, yeah, I just want to say that I'm really excited because, you know, as the founders of the Wellness Universe, we highly encourage everyone to live their best life because what we believe is that if you're living your best life, you can't be anything else but then happy, joyous, inspirational, um, neighborly, kind, <laughs> loving. And we want you to be this person, right? So we've gathered some amazing people to not only give you the top tips here today, we have Raylan, Maya, Suzanne, Manuela, and Rosemary. Um, you'll be able to meet these amazing women at Soul Treat Retreat live. So we are just gonna give you just a smidgen of their magical wonderfulness <laughs> today here because they're gonna be sharing their top tip for you to have the best life. You guys ready? Is everyone ready to meet these amazing women? Our first beautiful world changer hails all the way from, I don't know why I said this because I don't know everybody's location, but she she reigns from Mesa, Arizona. Please welcome Raylan St. Dunn. And if I said that wrong, I apologize. <laughs> hey, Raylan. It's okay, hey, you guys. It's Raylan St. Dunn. <laughs> it's all good. I add, a little, I add a little zest to everything. Yes. It just means incorrect. <laughs> we, love, we love zest. Zest is good. <laughs> totally. Well, Raylan, why don't you let everybody know first what it is that you do in the world besides be awesome? Oh, thank you, guys. Well, so as Sherry said, I live in Mesa, Arizona. I am the founder and creator and energy alchemist of The Healing Space. And you can find me on Facebook. It's in my profile in the Wellness Universe. But I work with individuals who are looking to live their best life, kind of come out of maybe backgrounds of trauma, um, backgrounds of childhood wounding and things like that. And they might be newly awakening to the spiritual path and or they're on it, but they want to further develop their skills and heal from within. So I just help hold the space for their healing. Beautiful. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for the work that you do in the world. And uh, in case anybody hasn't noticed, we've got some beautiful red rocks behind us from Sedona. Yes. Yes. Lovely. So uh, Raylan, thank you again for the work that you do. And I, you know, inner child work is very personal to me, as you know. Mm -hmm. So um, I'm really excited for what you will be sharing with our audience, both at um, the participants at Soul Treat, but here as well. So I know that it's a lot to ask somebody to share their top tip, because I'm certain you're like <laughs> me that you got a lot. Uh, so, but why don't you go ahead and share with everybody what you believe is a top tip to, for everybody here to live their best life. 
As you've said, it's really difficult to narrow that down. Uh, I would say top tip, really honestly, allow the emotions to come forward. You know, we get, uh, we really, my belief is that we are here in this human experience in order to um, experience and go through the wide range of emotions that we have as human beings and to heal those layers. And through the healing, we remember our soul and we re reunite and realign with it. So in all honesty, the way forward, the way through is in the feeling. Um, there is no shortcut. You're not going to outrun them. You're not going to climb over them, uh, move around them, etc. They're going to continue to follow you and chase you. And in every and any situation you find yourself, the common denominator is you. And so the top tip that I would share is that it's very, very critical to feel the emotions that come forward, witness them, see them, hear them, and then release them. Raylene, I want to just address that for a moment because I think a lot of people are afraid to face their emotions mm. and allow them to come out because mm. of the judgment. And again, mm. that goes to the inner child, whether we were scolded or stifled mm. when we were a child and we have that blockage. But I just want to say my personal opinion of when people are sharing or going through their emotions or, or emotions or at least identifying that they have something, you know, what they feel around something. I was just listening to a gentleman the other night, actually, as a matter of fact, and he, the way he explained something was so well attached to his emotional, um, experience of it i felt mm -hmm. like wow like what an evolved human that he can talk mm -hmm. and be respected for his opinion and he's a really smart person with a lot of influence mm -hmm. and yet talk about the the emotions he's experiencing for a certain situation i said mm -hmm. wow i'm i'm actually really impressed by that and i'm not judging on a negative level so i, I just mm -hmm. want to say thank you for allowing that space and helping people to you know go inward and address that and um, I know that, you know, we have about a minute and a half left for you to explain a little bit more, but I'd love for you to give us a little bit of what people can expect when they're at Soul Treat in your workshop. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's so important to um, feel the feelings and be authentic. You know, it does us no good when we hide and when we kind of uh, cover over and mask. We people can pick up on your energy anyway. They know what you're feeling. They can feel that energetic uh, frequency level. So you might as well own it and just be authentic. People appreciate authenticity. And so the space that I'll be creating um, and am creating even now is a space to be raw and authentic and to be able to then examine those tough emotions that, like you said, maybe have been conditioned and kind of um, forced out of us or forced us to repress or suppress. So we're going to explore ways to connect with them in a safe, loving, non-judgmental environment. I love that, Raylan. Love Thank it. You. Thank you. Beautiful. Well, we I'm excited. Yes, I know. Well, we look we so forward. For those of you who are just tuning in, we're talking to our wellness universe world changers, our wellness experts who are sharing their top tip for to live your best life, as well as these ladies are all going to be live at Soul Treat in Sedona, November 2nd and 3rd, which we'll talk as we go a little bit about Soul Treat and what you can expect. And Ray Lynn is going to be offering her workshop, which is called Transformational Work of Accessing, Exploring and Soothing Your Inner Child Self. And we cannot wait for it. So thank you. Thank you, Ray Lynn. Thank you for all the work you do. Thank, thank you. you sharing your best tip to live your best life. Thank you. Top tip. Thank you. Thank you. Love you. Oh my no, God. I love her. Yeah. I love her. So excited. Yeah. <laughs> energy. Remember when we met her in person last time, it was just like automatic. Boom. Like you just feel comfortable with Raylin. I just, I love her. Well, what was interesting is that Raylin came to soul treat in spring, which we had it there. And she came as one of our wellness universe friends. So someone who was a seeker of wellness, but she stood out and was like, what are you doing? You should be providing uh, yeah. these resources and these tips and these tools. So we asked her to join us and now she's going to be a, um, a workshop facilitator. So we hope that you will join us in November. Remember, 
that rhymed <laughs> in November. Okay. Remember that we are giving away a content a ticket at the end, so stay tuned. And now we are excited. Oh, wait, to wait a minute before we bring up Maya. Let's just remind everybody: please share this out right now to your groups, to your personal page, to if you have a Facebook uh, business page, just share it out everywhere and let us know that you shared it in the comments and also uh, share the the website to, so you can learn more about Raylan's workshop along with 30 other wellness universe world changers and what they're bringing to Soul Tree to support your wellness, uh, your wholeness, your happiness, you resetting and uh, releasing, releasing, releasing and resetting. So share the WooSoulTree.com site, share this live right now. This is a two-parter and then at the end, we're going to give you, and you have to hang in here till the end, we're going to give you a special key phrase that you have to repeat back to us so we know that you've been here. And that will enter we're you tricky. into... We're tricky. <laughs> you like that? We keep you here. Uh, but that'll help you be entered into winning that two-day wellness retreat pass to Woo Soul Treat that's worth almost $400. And that in and of itself is a bargain for a two day retreat where you have 30 people there to support your well being. So now without further ado, please share it. Without further ado. And I just wanna say this, this amazing woman is tuning in and joining us live from Australia. So if you wanna talk about commitment, it's about after midnight there. Oh, so yeah. welcome to here, Maya <laughs> Boston. Welcome Maya. Thank you. Thank you. Um, it's just so exciting to be on here with you guys, even if it is after midnight. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen someone look so good for after midnight. I wish oh, I oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so Maya, why don't you tell everybody um, a little bit about what it is that you do, which I know is a big question. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, uh, so I'm a, a gong practitioner and a light language channel. And uh, I've been uh, doing this for over 13 years. Um, I work with uh, people who are looking to uh, find ways to relieve the stress levels in life. Um, I also work with uh, people who uh, need um, to manage their chronic pain. And uh, I also work with cancer patients. So, um, so basically, yeah, uh, that's, you know, the, the, um, I guess my, um, my, 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 uh, the whole purpose of doing the, the gong sound, um, meditation is to bring people into a space where they can, uh, relax and, uh, release and reset, uh, their, their nervous system and their bodies and um and to yeah find and uh, go within and and begin to have a relationship with with themselves beautiful i am we'll talk a little bit about what you're actually going to do at soul treat and what they can experience because i just want to dive into it but there's more important thing well not more important but just as important um because i know everybody has shown up here for two reasons one to find out what your top tip is to live their best life and then, of course, to get a ticket to Soul Treat. So let's start with that. Uh, why don't you share with everybody what you believe is a top tip for us to live our best life? So my top tip is uh, to really um, underline the importance of carving out some time for yourself each and every day, even if that's only like 10 or 15 minutes. It is so important um, because science, science uh, tells us that even uh, the, the 10 minutes meditation that we do before we go to sleep releases much more uh, stress in that 10 minutes of meditation than we do, uh, say, in the first uh, three hours of, of our sleep. So it's really important to carve out some time. This is about uh, self-love, self-care practice as well. And, um, and just uh, noticing yourself and how you're re reacting to the things that are going on in your day. So it's really, uh, you know, when I say meditation, I don't say, I don't think, 
you know, that we should be sitting cross-legged somewhere chanting om to me. <laughs> um, <laughs> to me, it's, uh, you know, it's being comfortable, you know, sitting somewhere being comfortable and it's an introspection. It's noticing how our body is feeling in that moment because we're so much in our heads uh, during the, the course of our day that we don't even know uh, how we're feeling in the body. We don't notice the... Uh, escalating uh, stress levels that our bodies are holding um, and we, we're all doing this because we, we live these you know fast-paced um, 21st century lifestyles yeah. you know so so everybody's got some level of, of stress in their body so it's really important to to uh, take care of yourself to take to take the responsibility for yourself and uh and your health and uh and to do this uh it, it's can be just as short as 10 15 minutes each day my it's so important Maya, if I could jump in here, because we've got about a minute oh, left. And I want you to, no, I wanted to jump in. And because we got about a minute left, and I know that I want to hear a little bit more about the gong bath and about the sound wellness that you're going to do, be doing. Um, but I just want to say, I think that it is so super important for people to take that time for themselves. And that, that yeah. meditation and that mindful moment uh, to yourself is so essential. So if everyone who's listening, please take Maya's tip, because mm -hmm. it is um, so different when you take a conscious moment to clear your head than when you don't take that time, just like when you take that time to breathe. So Maya, I'm super interested in your gong bath and I am going to be attending your <laughs> workshop myself because I can't, cannot wow. wait. So can you please tell us a little bit about what it is that you're going to be doing at Soul Treat and the benefit of it? And we got about 15 seconds, but we're going to give you a little more time than that. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm going to be in, in a beautiful room um, in, in the Sedona Soul Treat. And uh, I will be doing a gong sound bath uh, meditation. And uh, the, the benefits of it, of course, um, as I was uh, saying earlier, is to help uh, the body relax, uh, to help uh, release and uh, reset so that you don't have so much stress in the body, um, to rebalance because it's, it's really uh, helping people to rebalance, to, to relax as well. And of course, all, all this is um, happening through your meridian and chakra systems. And um, you've got, um, you're, you'll be able to get your heart rate stabilized. Um, you know, if you're, if you're holding any pain, of course, uh, your, your brain will be releasing endorphins. And, um, and, it, and if you've got any injuries, of course, uh, you know, the sound, uh, sound helps with, uh, with recovery time, speeding up recovery time. So, um, so these are the benefits of sound meditation. And uh, you all get to uh, kind of walk out of that room after, after the gong sound bath and be walking on cloud nine. <laughs> I cannot wait. I could just imagine myself just totally vibrating from this, like just from head to toe. I cannot wait. Maya, yeah. thank you so much. Thank I am you. looking forward to meeting you. I cannot believe you're coming all the way from Australia oh. and, and part of this, bringing your energy, bringing that good energy from Australia because I know it's a whole different vibe down there than we have bring in the US. So thank you. You're bringing the gongs from Australia. <laughs> but thank you so much. And I look forward personally to being yeah. Im immersed in your healing techniques. So thank you so much, Maya. Thank you. Thank, thank, you. You, thank you. I'm really excited. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. Sure, Mary, you're terrible. She's really excited and she hopes that you come and join her, but she said it with this great Australian accent. Uh, so um, she will be joining, as she, as she alluded to um, this great room that she's talking about, we will be at Sedona Creative Life Center uh, at Four Soul Treat, and she's going to be in the beautiful chapel, floor to ceiling window, overlooking the red rocks. Amazing. With beautiful, being immersed in this beautiful sound. Um, these gong baths and stuff. And we hope that you will join us at Wu Soul Treat. We'll let you know really quickly a little bit about what it is. It's two full days 
where you get immersed in workshops and talks and experiential one-on-one -on -one sessions if you're a VIP ticket holder. And the first day is all dedicated to releasing, releasing what it is that you're holding on to, things that might limit you, um, things that you may not, the choices that you may not be making in your life. You basically know that you're holding on to something and that there's a bigger life for you. So our practitioners will help you release that. And then day two, is all about resetting your soul. So you have this beautiful, open, free space that's now been released. The stuff's been released, so there's all this beautiful room. And on day two, you're gonna be reset with tools and tips and just beautiful ways to be able to walk out into the world fully ready, fully powerful, fully you. Love it, and Sherry, love it. It's a holistic, it's a holistic wellness uh, retreat. And I just want to say that we're going to be staying at the Arabella Sedona and you're welcome to stay with us at the Arabella H Sedona. We stayed there last time. It's an amazing hotel. It's one of our partners. So just want to mention that. And again, to qualify for your two day, $397 ticket, you have to share this right now, share it to your personal page, share it to your business page if you have one, share it to your groups if you're part of groups, um, and also share the website woosoultreat.com. Come back here in comments and say shared, and then stick around till the end because we have three more amazing women giving us their top tip for your best life, and we're going to say a key word, and you're going to have to repeat it back to us in the comments in order to qualify for that ticket. Hey, it's a $400 ticket, two days in, in Sedona, Arizona with us and over 30 amazing Woo World Changers that are gonna be practicing there, plus additional Woo World Changers and Woo Friends that you're gonna walk away with a whole brand new family of support. Mm -hmm. It's it's amazing. So and on the next break, we'll tell you a little bit about some of the activities that we'll be doing in addition to the workshops and all that good stuff because it's a whole immersive retreat. All right, so without further ado, and I'm probably gonna mess this up, and I asked, but I'm gonna just try anyway. Um, and, and she hails all the way from New York. Please welcome Suzanne Sukan. Hello there. Did I do it right? Close enough. <laughs> Hi, Suzanne. Hello, hello. I'm super excited to be with you ladies. Woo! Woo, love it, and I love your necklace too, by the way. Thank you. Is it all chakras? Is it the chakras? Yeah, on cool. selenite. Yeah, I'm a crystal junkie. I, I've seen, I know a little bit about it. Gorgeous. Very beautiful. Well, thank you for joining us today. Thank you, number one, for being at Soul Treat with us. And you'll share a little bit about that later. But just being a world changer and the beautiful work that you are doing in the world to help create a better, happier, healthier, and more whole world. So thank you for that. All about it. All right. So why don't you just go ahead and tell everybody what it is that you do? Well, um, again, my name is Suzanne Sukan, and I'm a holistic healing practitioner. I'm a spiritual healer, astrologer, and a psychic medium, and I'm out of a suburb of Buffalo, New York. I just left a job at the IRS. Oh. <laughs> yes, <laughs> um, and I opened my private practice last July, and then gave it my all in April. Actually, I think April 15th, right around tax day. I was like, see ya. <laughs> I was gonna say, I bet you're, you're full of clients from all your former colleagues, right? You're full, of, you're full of clients from all your former <laughs> colleagues, right? Because <laughs> it's a very toxic place to work, you can imagine. Yeah. Well, that's where you, you know, you, you uh, filled your best self up. That's where you had to like, you know, learn everything is to be able to deal with that. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, so why don't then you share with us, because we're pretty certain that you've had to practice this in your own life since you had some toxic areas in your life. Uh, why don't you share with us what you believe that your top tip is for all of us to live our best life? Yes. Well, being an energy healer, um, also formerly a victim of domestic violence for 22 years, I had a really get back down to the base nitty gritty and rebuild my own self. So now that I get it and I can help other people to get it too, my best tip is that to know that you are divine. Live that way. Love it. That's it. So um, it's such a simple, simple thing. You know, we, we were all, I mean, the miracle of life is just, it's a miracle. And to, for us to understand the fact that we are we are divine, how can we allow 
ourselves to cut our own selves down or take what other people say as truth. No, we are divine. So you need to live that way and be that way. And another tip is to set a set an alarm on your phone a couple of times a day. And when that goes off, do a quick check of what you're thinking about. Make sure that it's positive and we need to understand to speak kindly to ourselves and not cut ourselves down. Beautiful. Oh my God, I love that, Suzanne. And honestly, that is such a strong tip that can really keep our vibration high. I think what you're saying is to really recognize the miracle that we are. I mean, what are the chances of us being here? It's like billions to one, billions for the egg and the sperm to meet, for us to be here as a miracle, seriously. And then recognize that. We are creation, we are creation. And we really need to respect that and take that mindful moment for ourselves. I love your tip, thank you so much. Now tell us a little bit more about what you're gonna be doing at Soul Tree. You actually have a little over two minutes left. Awesome. <laughs> uh, I can feel that quite easily. <laughs> but what I'll be doing at Soul Treat is, um, we'll be doing a guided meditation where we visit our own chakras. We go within our own selves and um, we are, it'll help us to have an, an inventory of our current status, let's say. Like, how do you feel in your root chakra? Do you feel that the universe will always provide for you? And most people have a wonky root chakra because nobody was raised perfectly. Mm -hmm. And one of the biggest issues when we have this wonky root chakra is that we go out into the world and we work a billion hours and we push ourselves to the point of exhaustion and our adrenals are just gonna blow out. So as we do this, we're out in the world, we're working too much, giving too much, not allowing ourselves to receive, our receiver's broken. And we need to understand that the universe will provide for us when we, put ourselves out too much, things break down. And so it's getting reset in that root chakra, knowing that the universe will always provide for us because why? Because we are divine. So once we start with that root and we re-stabilize that root chakra, we have a talk with that root and we say, you have to be strong for us because all the rest of the chakras have to stack on top of you. And if you already have a wonky floor, then the next one up is the sacral. And that's how we do relationships and how we see and perceive our own selves out in the world. So if you have a wonky root, the next one up is going to be wonky too. So it's kind of like that game when the boxes come falling down and you're that platform that's going back and forth. So if you're wonky, everything else is coming down all wonky and you're just trying to balance it all and we just can't do it so the work that i do we start we get that root chakra reestablished and strong and then we go up from there and when we and the most important one is the heart we actually don't need all of our chakras they were placed there and kids nowadays don't even have a root chakra and we can actually dissolve our chakras but the only thing that we need is our heart and that is where the unconditional love comes from that's the source of of the healing work that I do, it's unconditional love. And then we will wrap the um, that whole session with a group with a group healing feeling. You will feel it. A group <laughs> a feeling, feeling healing. And uh, we open our hearts and we all connect and we feel it. And it's amazing. So <laughs> it's you can tell that this is going to be a really boring workshop. I know. Oh, yeah. we, got, we, got, we got to bring a little more energy, Suzanne, please. A little, a little more energy. Suzanne, this sounds really exciting. And for one, I, everyone knows that I am all about energy healing. I all, am all about the chakras and I am such a, uh, an advocate for what you do. So I am looking forward to what you what you bring and I'm looking forward to, to you introducing it to people who don't know anything about it because I think that what you're going to be giving them is actually a great introduction, you know, uh, to and a great healing session so they can really experience and get immersed in it. But I just want to say thank you for being part of Soul Treat. Thank you for being here today. Thank you for those you gave us a two for a tip. You gave us two <laughs> tips. So I want to say thank you for that. Awesome. Thank you so Thank much. You. We cannot wait to see you in November. It's going to be sweet. Sweet. Bye. It is. You're fantastic. Thanks, Suzanne. Alrighty. Oh, my gosh. Alrighty. What amazing.
women we have so far. Sorry, Sharon. I know. No, I just want to say, just so everybody understands, I'm having a little technical challenge. And the reason why I'm bringing this up on this end is that if you are commenting, my comments froze. So if you're commenting, I just want to let you know, I'm not ignoring you. I just don't actually see them. So um, we'll come back and comment at the end and share. So just wanted to let you know that really quickly. But before we bring on our next beautiful world changer, I want to just be able to share a little bit about some of the activities that are going to be happening at Soul Treat. So for those of you who've ever attended a conference, so it's very, conferences are filled with the workshops and the different events and the things happening. And while we call this a retreat, it's like a two for, because you get all of the workshops, you get all of the event part of it, like you do at a conference. But the retreat aspect is the fact that at conferences, you have the people up there on the stages who present their stuff and then they go off on their own and they go and do their thing and they return home. But at Soul Treat, you get to connect directly with our workshop facilitators and speakers. You get to break bread with them. We'll be eating lunches together. In the evening, we're gonna have this beautiful, on night one, this beautiful poolside fire pit mixer over at the hotel where you get to spend a few hours, all of us together. In the morning, we'll be led uh, leading a yoga session, which I'll introduce you to the lovely woman who's gonna do that in just a minute. But we'll morning vortex walks. What I mean is that it's not just they're on stage, you learn, and then they get the heck out of there. It's a fully immersive soul to soul meeting, connecting of the hearts and minds. And that's what Soul Treat really is. So I just wanted to be able to share that with you. Thanks, Sherry. Thanks for sharing that. All right. So without further ado, <laughs> wait, one more. Gonna... just want to remind oh. everyone again, because somebody, yes. people could have joined us. Please, uh, we're doing a free a free ticket to Soul Treat. Somebody's going to win. Somebody right now from here is going to win a two-day ticket to Soul Treat, three hundred and ninety-seven dollars. How much? Three hundred and ninety-seven dollars, <laughs> um, which in and of itself is an amazing value to get everything that you're going to get and more, and um, more surprise to be announced over the coming weeks. Um, but in order to do that, please share this live on your personal page, uh, to your groups that you belong to, to your Facebook page, if you have Facebook pages, and also share the website, woosultreat.com. So once you share those two things uh, out to your peeps, to your friends, to your loved ones, to people who you know need it, um, <laughs> come back here and just say shared in the comments. And then the second part is hang with us till the end. And we're going to give you a password. And then you're going to have to type in the password. And then we know that you've done the shared part and you've stayed till the end. And then you're going to qualify and be random. Someone is going to be randomly selected to win that two day ticket to Soul Treat to be with us with all of these wonderful women that you just met today and more. We have over 30 people giving workshops and experiences at Soul Treat that you're going to personally connect with. You're going to get personally helped, personally supported, personally loved, personally hugged, personally, you know, just everything coddled and, and, <laughs> and just make you feel good. So. Without further ado, Sherry, you wanna introduce our next wonderful woman? I do, and this wonderful woman hails all the way from Santa Rosa, California. She is beautiful, she is my friend, she is a Wellness Universe World Changer. She was at the prior Soul Treats offering her beautiful, amazing workshop, and she is here with us again. Please welcome Manuela Rohr. Hi, Manuela. Hey, Hello. Manuela. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I'm tall. I'm on my screen, I'm taller than you. <laughs> <laughs> we can sit up a little taller. Now yeah, I am shorter. shorter. Yeah, oh, there we go. <laughs> but when it switches modes, we get cut off a little bit, so it doesn't matter. Okay. It's okay. Yeah, that's fun. So, Manuela, welcome. We are so excited to have you back. This is for Soul Treat in November, mm -hmm. um, which we'll talk about more about what you're doing in just a minute. But why don't you just let everybody know a little bit about what it is that you do in life in general? Okay. All right, I'm a passionate yoga teacher and yoga therapist for over 30 years. I started out with a typical yoga uh, train of uh, uh, teaching, which I loved, and added the Phoenix Rising yoga therapy approach like 20 years ago. And that really changed the way I, I live, the way I teach, and how I would like to share with everybody who's interested in joining me and 
I want to say everybody can do the practice I offer, not, and not only somebody who is thinking they are flexible. I invite everybody, no matter what the limitations, to join me on the mat and learn this amazing skill that I would call embodied mindfulness, where we practice moment-to-moment -moment awareness, using the breath and connecting to our body as we move to feel where we are in the present moment and not where we thought we should be or could be, but rather really saying yes to the moment I'm in as I practice. So this is a transformational work to help you reconnect to your body in a way that it's your best friend through life. Beautiful. I, I love the work that you do both professionally and personally with your own um, daughter, which I'm sure, you, well, I'm not sure, but you might mention. Uh, it, <laughs> I don't know. I just, no, because for anyone, you, you got to come to Soul Treat to meet Manuel. You got to come to meet everybody, but um, she lives an exceptional life and is an exceptional woman. So the work that she does really, she walks her talk. So I just want to say that. Manuela, why don't you share with everybody? Because I, I, why don't you share with everyone what you believe is the top tip for your best life, to live your best life? Yes. I have one tip that I want to share that kind of chimes into what everybody else already said, because right, we have that one body and we all have a life with all the triggers and all the challenges and victories in it. And my tip is an awareness break. The willingness to pause is the first step. You've got to, to remember that you are important. And I always want to, before I share it, want to remind you when you, if you ever have taken a flight, I'm sure most of us have, in this pre-session um, when they say put the oxygen mask on first. That's what I want to share. If I don't put the oxygen mask on first, how will I ever be helpful to anybody else? So if I learn to pause in my day often, and I also believe it can be a minute pause, I put stickers on my screen. I have right now, I don't know if you see that, I put letters on my wrist <laughs> this says breathe. And I choose a letter every day and I say, this is what I want to focus on, to pause and breathe. The awareness break is a 20 second awareness break. 20 seconds of your day, a few times a day, is about three breaths. And in this three, in this 20 seconds, you pause. You close your eyes if you like. You can keep them open and focus on something that doesn't distract you. You connect to your breath. You breathe in, you breathe out, you let go. And then you notice your feelings. You notice what is going on, especially when you have been triggered. You know it's burning. What's going on right now? You connect to this feeling, you breathe again, and with an aha, I just noticed, you let what you noticed go with the exhalation. No ticket attached, no value attached. It doesn't matter what you have been feeling. You just say, I'm willing to let this go right now. And with the next breath, you accept what you ju were just feeling and you choose, that's the tip, choose how you want to feel. So don't yeah. act from the trigger you just had, but act from what you want to feel. So do this before you open the door to your home, before you know you are going into a loaded um, situation, but just do it for your own sake when you were triggered and you feel, oh my God, I messed it up again. Happens in my life every day. I live with a special needs daughter. I'm triggered to the point, like that's sometimes unbearable, but I can stop afterwards and say, and to do my break, my 20 seconds break, notice that I feel, oh God, I lost it again. Accept it, I'm human. Let it go, move on with the feeling I want to create. The I love it. I love it. I love Manuel. And yes, you are walking your talk, as Sherry said before. Now, I we're running out of time, but I really want you <laughs> to share what it is that you're going to be bringing to Soul Treat specifically. Right. And I will say that your last workshop brought people to tears. Literally, it brought people to tears. It touched people so deep, men and women. My uncle. And I didn't want to mention Uncle, oh. but yes, Uncle Gary. <laughs> I don't want to mention names. Uh, trying to respect privacy. No, but, okay. <laughs> Manuela, please elaborate on what it is. If you, ha you have about 30 seconds. Okay. <laughs> All right, 30 seconds. What I will do is I will guide you to connect to yourself with your breath first 
and with the words I use to guide you through the movements that your body can do in this moment. I guide you to let go of that concept of what you cannot do or what you don't like about your body, but what you can embrace in this special moment. Gentle movements to more bigger movements, it's your choice. You will walk away knowing it's your choice how you want to be with your body. And that's why I mean everybody, every type of body can join this practice because you will be working on your level, on where you can be in this moment. That's my goal. I'm, I'm thrilled when I walk out and I see people say, wow, I didn't know this is possible for me. Yeah. I got in breath, mind, soul, spirit, smiles. I'm, I'm gonna, I love it. It's beautiful. I, and I'm just going to throw my uncle under the bus again because he's a six <laughs> foot five man who isn't very in his body. And he was afraid to go to your workshop, but he was like, you know what? I'm just going to do it. That's why he was there to throw himself into his own healing and everything. And it was his favorite workshop that he took. He put it out there. He cried. He was very in touch. And he's like, you're one of the main reasons why he wants to come back. Just so you know mm -hmm. that. So, um, that. so everything that you're doing. Because that would open, that opens the door to everybody who still thinks I'm not going on a yoga mat. Right. So, drop it right now. Come. Yes. Yeah. Well, yeah, for sure. You are someone to experience. Manuela, thank you so much. I honor you for all the work you do. And I honor you for walking the path that you walk and have accepted it and embraced it and use it as your platform to really be guided to help people in the magnitude that you do. So I just want to say thank you so, so much. And I love your shirt, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> so pretty. It's my, it's my chain. Ah. Yeah. It's Namaste. We'll see you on the Red Rocks. Right. <laughs> right. Bye, Manuela. Oh. Thank you, Manuela. Bye. Bye. Love her. Love her. Okay, so I, I am pretty certain that there's tons of comments coming in about everybody sharing how amazing this live is and all of the great things. I can't see them, but I know they're there. So. <laughs> I know neither can I. So yeah, if you've been sharing this, please just say shared, shared in the comments. Just Well, you only have to say it once. Say shared in the comments. <laughs> and that's step one to win that two-day pass to Soul Treat and meet Manuela, Suzanne, Maya, Raylin, and who we're going to bring up ro next, Rosemary, along with um, over 30 other amazing wellness universe world changers that help facilitate um, and accelerate your, your roadway, your highway, your experience, your journey to healing. Um, it's just it's just incredible. And, and here we are with these amazing people that showing you their, their top tip. And just to be here for this one little tip, it's great to meet them in person and to feel their vibe and their energy, obviously. Um, it's kind of a no brainer. So anyway, so share this out, share to your personal page, share to your Facebook pages, share to your groups, write the word shared in the comments, share woosoultreat.com, share the website. And that's the first step to being entered to win that two day ticket. That's worth $397 to come with us to Soul Treat in Sedona, Arizona in November. And then at the end, hang out with us right after Rosemary. We're going to give you a special password. The password is... <laughs> and then you're going to put the password in the comments and then you'll be qualified and a one person will be randomly selected from sharing and putting in that keyword uh, to win that ticket. That's it. So somebody is going to win today. Someone today. Who knows us is going to win. So just to wrap that up really quickly, there's three steps. Number one, share this interview. Number two, share the link, woosoultreat.com. Actually, I totally lied. There's four steps. The third step is to come back here and write shared. And then the fourth step is to put the secret code, the passcode, the keyword at the end when we share that with you. Um, definitely go check out woosoultreat.com. Besides the people you're seeing today, we're going to be bringing people over the next five weeks or so. Next Sunday, we'll be here with more wellness world changers for you. Oh, sorry, let me let me just mention, I think that we're going to sell out of tickets before we even get through these interviews. So oh, for sure. It, yeah. I mean, even if you buy a ticket and then you end up winning a ticket at one of the later ones, we can credit you back. Just so you know, um, you're still el eligible to win a ticket, um, even if you had bought your ticket. So if you're thinking about coming, if you're considering it, if you know that this is something you need for you, for you and your best friend, for you and your mom, for you and your daughter, for you and your your husband, wife, um, 
boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever, this is the space. Get your tickets now. We're more than halfway sold out. So just want to put that out there because totally didn't even talk about that before, Sherry, <laughs> that we must mention the tickets are limited, just so you know. They are limited as well as we're offering, which we haven't even talked about yet, either VIP ticket exposure. Oh, which is an amazing, amazing, you know what? I'm going to tell everybody about the VIP after our next guest. Yes. Good idea, <laughs> Sherry. Good idea. Yeah, That's what I'm here for. I'm here for the good ideas, everybody. All right. So uh, without further ado, I'm bringing on Wellness Universe world changer, beautiful, lovely, Rosemary Levesque. Did I do that correctly? Yes, you did. <laughs> Hello, nice Rosemary. Nice. Welcome. <laughs> Hey, how are you? We're so good. It's so okay. nice to have you here with us. Thank you. Thank you. And oh my gosh, what wonderful presenters are here on online today. I'm just going like this the whole <laughs> time because yes, I want that. I want that. I want that. That's yeah. what, and, and I'm not again selling soul tree, but that's the feeling that you get when you're there. Like if you're just here mm -hmm. on the live experiencing that, like what yeah. we feel in person and what just the expertise and the souls and the spirits that are just there. It's so beautiful and, and nobody should miss it. And I can't wait to feel yours in person as well. Um, Yay. Yours, okay, <laughs> yeah, we'll talk about that in a minute, but I'm always jumping the gun. Um, <laughs> that's what I do because I get excited. Uh, so why don't you tell everybody, Rosemary, a little bit about what it is that you do. I am, uh, first of all, I want to mention I'm a former biology teacher. So I experienced the very much being in the head, the science of life, studying all the formats and so forth. And then uh, there were these awakenings. You know, everybody thinks there's only one awakening. No, no, no. There are many awakenings that we have as we integrate these awakenings. And so I became Reiki master, remembering that I am a shaman also. And, and I am also trained as a certified vibrational sound master teacher. I'm a licensed spiritual healer and so on and so forth. I teach, I do sessions. It's all amazing and everything is all integrated because I don't leave anything out. There's so no you menu. every time. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> you do a lot. Yeah. And, and I'm an author. I work with animals as well. Uh, I wrote a book called Natural, uh, it's called Heal Together Natural Health Solutions for Animals and Their Humans. I love that. Because we're together. We do, we do things together. Yeah. Beautiful. I love that because you're, you know, basically encapsulating all, all of life experience, all of earth, all of us, all of our animals. Beautiful. Yes. I love all it. All of it. Love yes. it. So in, in all of your life experiences and all the work that you've done, because you've obviously traveled many highways and have done the science and the spiritual, even though it all works together, uh, I am very intrigued as to what you believe is your top tip for us to live our best life. Well, sound has taught me a lot. And there is a concept of dissonance and resonance. And you know that uh, when you resonate with something, you, you feel good about it. You're, you're in harmony with it, right? But when something is dissonant, it makes you feel different, right? And so all of the sounds that are dissonant out there in the world, whether it's uh, a scary movie or airplanes flying overhead, uh, that was one of mine. <laughs> Why are these airplanes flying overhead? And uh, this is tied into my tip, is we subconsciously hold on to everything, everything, every here, every experience we have in every cell of our body. So here's where the biology ties into the spirituality. When we hold on to these things, we don't even realize we're doing it. What is it that will release it is harmonizing with what is here on earth in its natural form. And one of the most profound gifts that we have is the sound of OM. OM. There's a reason why uh, OM is used in meditation. There's a reason why it's, it's a symbol written on everything. <laughs> you find it everywhere. It's even jewelry, right? And so if you can just 
become aware of, and I heard other presenters talk about this as well, uh, perhaps there's a trigger. For me, it was why is our home suddenly in the path of um, whatever the airlines are doing? You know, why are these commercial flights flying over our house every five minutes? Made me crazy until I remembered OM. And they became my OM planes. Mm-hmm. So every time I heard a plane go overhead, I went, oh, mm. and so I'll be bringing um, tuning forks. And if you don't have an own tuning fork to listen to, you always have your voice. So I would suggest harmonizing with OM and use this as a tool for reprogramming that trigger that may be setting off something in you to make you feel agitated, make you feel stressed or whatever, find the sound, maybe it's not own, but find the sound that can manifest into physical form in your body because that's what sound does. It manifests into physical form. I love, I love that, uh, Rosemary. And we're running, we're running out of time, but I, I want you, that was a great tip, first of all, because I think it, it, it's the vibration, it's the sound, it's, it works at almost every cell in your body when you're going and doing that and you're being mindful of it. So I think mm-hmm. that was a wonderful tip. So thank you. Um, I would love for you to share more of what you're going to be doing at Soul Treat. Uh, It has to do with, uh, I see the label there, Healing Ancestral and Karmic Signatures. That's the name for it. But there's there's something about that remembering that the body holds on to, and we don't know why. We are experiencing patterns in our life that may have been something that we lived before. And it can be some kind of relationship something or other. Uh, We don't know what these signatures are, but uh, with some guidance, I will be your guide. Uh, You can help reveal some of these patterns that are showing up in your life. And uh, since I am in the release portion of the event, then I will show you some techniques for releasing those signatures so that you don't have to repeat all that stuff. We'll just put it under the category of stuff. (laughs) (laughs) I like it. Perfect word to describe it. Perfect. I I love that because that's what most of us do carry around when we're in these patterns, you know, and a lot of us don't even understand that we do carry them and hold on to them. So it's looking very forward to your workshop and you helping guide us and facilitate that for us. Thank you. Yeah, Thank, you. To Thank you, Rosemary. And with your background and your experience and all of the areas that you cover, I think it's going to be just a profound, profound experience because it's much more than just releasing. It's everything that you're personally bringing. Like no one can do this workshop like you're going to do it. And I think that it's going to be perfect for <laughs> anyone who comes to it. So thank you. Thank you, and I I love that we get to hang out with everybody who's there. I'm also planning a few days before and after the event to be in Sedona. Beautiful. So I'll I'll be around. Fantastic. (laughs) Thank you, Rosemary. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. Can't wait. Yeah, really. I can't wait. Great energy. Wow, what fantastic Ooh. lady, Sherry. I'm oh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I know. Um, say, like November can't come soon enough, but we still have more work to do with this. <laughs> so I can wait. But for the energy and the just, it was such a beautiful experience. And I just want to encourage you guys that if you're here watching this and you're even thinking about it, like, oh, I should, and there might be all these reasons why you can't or whatever, just say yes. Just say yes to you. We are, November is right at the end of 2019. And I always bring this up because I think it's so super important. We all have all these goals in the beginning of the year and the ways that we want to live and learn and change and everything. And I believe that this is the best way to close out the year is this complete transformation of yourself and your soul and your life. Being surrounded by the most amazing people, the most love, the most, just all of it, fun. It's going to be a fun time. It's going to be an amazing time. So. Sherry, since you mentioned that, I wanted to mention that, you know, 
it's a great early Christmas present, Hanukkah present, end of year present, New Year's present, an early present to give because by the time those actual holidays and days roll, dates roll around, they will be living yeah. the gift that you gave them at Soul Treat because they will walk away transformed. They will walk away supported. They will walk away connected to all of these wonderful women and more. And by the way, we do have some men presenters. So I know they say, I keep saying women, 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 but we have men presenters and we more than welcome men to come to Soul Treat. Um, so again, first step to win a ticket to Soul Treat, a two day pass for Woo Friends share this, share this interview right now, click share, share it to your personal page, share it to your group, share it to your Facebook pages, and also share wusoultreat.com. That's the actual website where you can go and get your tickets, as well as um, check out more information about the workshops. And also Sherry's going to be telling you about a VIP ticket. But again, I just want to stress, just want to stress that if you join us at the beginning of November, not only you, and if you're going to give this ticket to somebody as their gift for a holiday, by the time holiday rolls around, New Year's rolls around, they're going to be living the life that you wanted to help them ease into from being at Soul Treat by the time the holiday rolls around. So it's a wonderful early holiday gift if you're looking to bring someone with you, because this is the type of experience that we've had small groups, we've had couples, we've had mom and daughter at the last Soul Treat. And they had, they deepened their relationships. They helped each other um, through so much by being at Soul Treat through the releasing and the resetting. And then by going through those experiences together, they're able to help support each other on their journeys and understand more of who they are and how they can help the other one to become more of who they want to be. And I just want to say, don't just take our word for it. Um, go to woosoultreat.com. All of the testimonials and reviews are at the bottom. They, it will transform you. And I get emotional and I, you know, I'm not that good of an actress. <laughs> it is an amazing, amazing time. Um, I just, we want to share with you as well, something that we've added to this new Soul Treat, which is really exciting, Soul Treat Fall. We have added VIP tickets and it's only for 35 people. And what this does is this gets you number one, early online registration. We're gonna have three tracks of workshops happening at the same time and you get to choose which ones you want. So as a VIP ticket holder, you get first choice. So that's number one. Number two, you get a discount on our next Soul Treat. Then next, as a VIP ticket holder, you will also receive a special Soul Treat gift and then physical gift. And then the most exciting thing is, is that we are gonna be having a Soul Treat Fair on day two, on November 3rd, and for two hours, you get to go one-on-one -on -one with our different practitioners who will do little mini readings and mini sessions for you. So that in and of itself is worth your VIP ticket. Again, only 35, we are halfway sold out of those. Those are first come, first serve, and that is only $100 more. So for $100 more, you're gonna get a whole bunch of one-on-one -on -one sessions, mini readings of your own, as well as early registration and everything else that I mentioned. So it's definitely worth it. Uh, Anna and I and the Wellness Universe, we kept all of this really affordable for you because it's our mission to be able to create a better world. And the best way to be able to do that is to create better use. And, uh, and what that means is you're already perfect as you are, but there's always a best version of ourselves, right? And at Soul Treat, you will uncover this best version of you. I love it. I love it. I love it. And we have people coming from all over the world. We have people coming from UK, uh, Vienna, from Israel, from Australia. You met Maya earlier, um, all, US, Canada, from all over the world to go to Soul Treat. It is really a remarkable, dynamic, immersive um I want to say majestical place in Sedona, the environment, as well as just these amazing world changers that are going to be there for you. As Sherry mentioned earlier, and I'm repeating in case you weren't here <laughs> earlier, um, the difference here is that these are the real people that you're going to meet. Our world changers are going to be there for four days. You're going to be part of workshops, um, events, that take place over the course of two days. 
our world changes are going to be there for you, not only through their workshop, but personally. We are going to have casual time together. We're going to come together as a big group at the end of each day and share our experience of what we received in our workshops. We're going to come together as big groups and have a meditation. We're going to come together. We're going to do vortex walks. And if you don't know what a vortex walk is, it's a hike. It's a hike through the red rocks. You're going to feel the energy and you're going to go off on your own, in your own direction if you want to, or stay with a small group of people as we walk through the red rocks in Sedona in the morning before the workshops start. We're going to have breakfast together. If you stay at the Arabella with us, Sherry and I will be staying at the Arabella Sedona. Amazing hotel. So accommodating. So wonderful. Um, our partner hotel of choice. Uh, and we're going to have the event at the Sedona Creative Life Center, which is absolutely amazing. Three different rooms we're going to occupy with all of these amazing workshops and all of these amazing people. And it, um, it just goes without saying, it's like something you've never gone to before. And something that you will never go to again until you have, until you come to another soul treat. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Um, it's, uh, I don't want to just keep repeating ourselves. Definitely go check out woosoultreat.com. Read all about it. You'll be able to go to the workshop page and see all of the other workshops that are happening, all of the VIP sessions that are happening. I mean, it's literally like a, I was going to say it's like confetti because that's what keeps coming to me. It's just like, it's it's just, it's amazing. It's, it's a confetti of amazing people. Um, so we definitely want you to do that. We want to thank so much Maya Boston for being here with us. I'm not going to say last names because I'm just going to add some zest to them. So Maya and Suzanne and Rosemary and Manuela and Ray Lynn for joining us today and sharing with you their top tips for living your best life. And now... I think, Anna, what do you think? Do you think okay, that- Okay, well, 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 one last time. Okay. We want to make sure that you share this. So share this out, even though we're practically done, at least the people will have access to watch the recording. And then come back in the comments and write the word shared. All right? So as you're doing that, we're going to give you two seconds just to click share to your, to your uh, Facebook page, to your profile. And then after you write the word shared in comments... We're sharing now with you the keyword, the password. The password is... But you're show. sharing two things first. You're sharing two things first. You're sharing this interview and you're sharing the link, woosoultreat.com. Once you share those two things, then you come here and you write shared, which you should have done already, right? Because you're so excited to get to Soul Treat. And now, as Anna mentioned and alluded to. Sherry, the password is... Red Rocks. Red rocks. <laughs> red rocks. So type in red rocks into the comments. Now, what we're going to do is everyone who's now typed red rocks, we're going to make sure that prior to you putting in red rocks in the comments that you've typed in the word shared at an earlier point in this entire interview. And then of you who have done those two things, we're going to put everyone in a list and assign a number, and then I'm going to go over this wonderful little thing called random.org, and I'm going to put the parameters in, 1 to 20 or whatever, and then I'm going to hit random, and it's going to give me a number. Whatever person is assigned to that number is going to be the person who wins the Soul Treat ticket. We're going to message you. We're going to reply to your comment where it says Red Rocks and say you won the ticket to Soul Treat, and we're going to private message you. And once we private message you, we're just going to get the all clear that you got the ticket. We're going to collect some personal information and let you know that you got that ticket to Soul Treat. What we want to let you know also is that you win the ticket to the retreat. You're responsible for how you get there. So either walk, hop on, hop on a sheep, take a bike, take a train, take a plane, take a boat, um, you know, get piggybacked over there. Any which way you get to Soul Treat in Sedona, that's that's on you. And um, and your stay. So why don't you drive there? You can stay in your camper. Hey, we had somebody at Soul Treat last year, Eileen Dillon. She drove in her uh, RV and stayed in it while she was presenting at Soul Treat. So your mode of transportation could also be your place where you stay. So just so you know, you're getting the ticket. Whoever's going to win is going to win the ticket for the for the retreat itself. But you're responsible for your travel and accommodations. Just so you know, okay. Beautiful. So I, again, I can't see the comments right now. So I know that there's a bunch of shared and red rock happening right now. And you are probably the one that's going to win. So I'm excited for you. <laughs>
<laughs> really excited. Um, guys, thank you so much for hanging in and being a part of this. As you can see, Anna and I are just a little bit passionate about this. <laughs> a bit. And just, just a little bit. Um, so we definitely appreciate you and really hope that you commit to this, whether you win the ticket or not, grab your seat, grab your best friend, grab someone that you love, get your holiday presents out early. And like Anna said, if you buy your ticket now and you win, we will refund your money or add it to next year. Soul Tree will do something. So don't you worry about it. But we really highly recommend that you should grab your ticket no matter. Yeah, secure your ticket, get your ticket if you really want to come, which we highly recommend. And this is no, this is really just not BS or anything because we know the tickets are going to sell out. Period in the story. They sold out last time. This time we we're tripling the size of Soul Tree, yet keeping it as intimate as it was last time. So we really keep that experience that everyone receives that personal attention and they have a deep dive within themselves, within yourself. And you really experience all the testimonials that you are going to be reading about Soul Tree, that you're going to have the same experience too. Even though it's a little bit bigger we've broken it down where everybody still gets the same attention. And actually we've added other opportunities to get connected on a more casual basis and a get to know us basis. So we have even more of that put into place for this soul treat. So uh, again, woosoultreat.com is where you get your ticket um, or tickets and we are half sold through. So please consider getting your tickets as soon as you can. Um, and, and that's it. What else, yeah, Sherry? Say, no matter how big we get, I'll still be uh, giving out stickers that say I'm a hugger. So <laughs> that's what happens there. So you definitely want to join us. Um, no matter what part of your life you're in, whether you are a hugger or you're not a hugger, what you're going to get is a whole lot of commitment, a whole lot of uh, safe space, a whole lot of love, and a whole lot of transformation. Uh, so we cannot wait to see you there. Thanks so much. Thanks. And join us next week. Is it next week that we have yeah. the next one? Okay, yeah. because we skipped, I think, Labor Day weekend. But next week, you'll be introduced to three more uh, Woo World Changers who are going to be at Soul Treat with us with their top tip to live your best life. So we're going to be sharing about that too. So stay tuned and set your reminder because that's also another chance. I mean, and once you've won, so if you won one time, you only win one time. So just so you know. <laughs> but there's another opportunity next week to win a ticket to Soul Treat. But again, like we said, please just get your ticket if you want to come so it's secured and you got your ticket. And if you win it, we'll credit you back. Because once those tickets are gone, we have a cap at 120 to 130 people. They are gone. No more winning tickets, no more giving out tickets, no more buying tickets, nothing, nada, kaput, finished. So get your tickets. <laughs> we will see you next Sunday, August 18th. Same time, same place, 12 Eastern, 9 Pacific. And uh, you're going to meet some amazing people. Anna, always a pleasure. Sherry, always a pleasure. And I want to say special thank you to Raylynn, Maya, Suzanne, Manuel, and Rosemary. Awesome, awesome ladies. Thank you so much. And thank you for making the Soul Treat experience happen for 130 people on November 2nd and 3rd. Thank you. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you soon. Red Rocks. Bye.